Good morning and welcome to PLZ Soccer. This is your Scottish News Bulletin for Wednesday. Rangers assistant manager Gary McAllister has claimed that all his club needs is one trophy to bring belief back to Ibrox ahead of tonight's League Cup quarter-final against Livingston. McAllister added that it is an early opportunity to get to Hamden and that Rangers do want to win the tournament. I think a first trophy would, would bring back greater belief within the club and the and the, the fantastic fan base that we've got here, you know, and the, the people that come to Ibrox. So getting that first one is, 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 is crucial. Celtic boss Neil Lennon is wary of the threat new manager Ian McCall poses at Partick Thistle ahead of their quarter-final this evening. Lennon said he wants to take the luck element out of the tie as he aims to win the League Cup for the first ever time. Elsewhere, Hearts will host Aberdeen at Tynecastle, buoyed by their derby win on Sunday, and will Kilmarnock pile more misery on Hibernian. All quarterfinals kick off at 7.45. Euro Millions winner Colin Weir has reserved, reversed sorry, his decision to withdraw financial backing for Partick Thistle, instead supporting a Thistle fan group to take control of the club. Thistle Forever proposes to buy the South Terrace area and main stand from Fairhill Developments and run the Glasgow club for the community. And UEFA have announced that if Scotland do qualify for Euro 2020 next summer, then they will be drawn in England's group and face them at Wembley. Scotland's other two group fixtures would be at Hampden, but this is all hypothetical, of course. Let's have a quick glance at the papers then. The record report on links with Steven Gerrard replacing Jurgen Klopp at Liverpool. The Sun run a similar story with the German keen on the idea. And the Daily Mail focus on Kieran Tierney, who had a successful debut at Arsenal last night. Thank you for watching this morning. Stay with us on PLZ. Uh, we will be reporting from Fernando Rickson's funeral. His cortege is passing uh, through Ibrox at one o'clock. So we'll be there for all of the footage from that, as well as uh, the football show at 5.30. Mm -hmm.